Hey, hey, y'all, what's going on? Welcome to my channel, T-Girl Magic Tarot, here to do a reading for my ch ch gemini my Geminis. What's going on, Gemini? High vibe, cross watcher, everyone is welcome and loved. Thank you for being here. Thank you for joining me. Okay, I'm sending you all the love, light, and healing energy, 100 million trillion fold to you. Thank you for all your love and your support, your likes, your subscribes, um, your donations, like everything, Gemini. Thank you. It's a general message now. It's not going to resonate with everybody or nobody. So, only, dang, somebody all over the place. So, only take what fits and leave the rest, y'all, okay? <clears throat> Choir, come to the front. One, two, three. Oh, T-Girl, T-Girl, Magic and Collective. T-Girl, 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 Magic and Collective. T-Girl, T-Girl, oh, Magic and Collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Oh, my God. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we sing. Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Look at that, Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Oh my God, Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Yay! Okay, let's get right into this. Okay, this is deep for me. The energy, some you're resisting, Gemini. Okay, so somebody's resisting you. Somebody is brought heart. You know what? The song that popped in my head is by Anita Baker. I keep hearing, "You're my angel, mm, mm, mm. my angel." So you're somebody's angel. I don't know what's going on, child. You ain't talking to them. Look, they sad as. Fuck, because you ain't hearing them, you ignoring them, you ain't seeing them. Oh, angel. So you somebody angel, Gemini. Look, you done walked away. <laughs> you done took all your, you see how you done came up out that water and took all your emotions back. It was burning that one time, but they done made you mad. You done burnt clump crap. Look, look at you, Gemini. You moved away from this person. They sad that you done cut them out and everything. They keep saying, oh, my angel, you my angel, darling angel. I'm so sad. Lord have mercy. Holy Spirit, what the hell is this? I don't want to. What is this? Time out. Look at them. This have nostalgic memories and feelings about you. Okay, so it could be an age difference between you and this person, a height difference. They could be, be an animal lover. You could have dogs. They could have a golden retriever. You could have a golden retriever. This person is very immature when they walked away from you, but they walked away from you, and now they're in the five of cups feeling sad and lost. Look at them. They're feeling sad and lost. Okay, maybe you changed the locks on this person. Some of you don't kick this person out. Okay, they feeling left out of the cold. But at the end of the day, they did that to themselves, okay? This key, the key is right there, as you see. For some of y'all, all they got to do is do the right thing and, and, and look at, uh, take their blinders off, okay? And see that the key is right there. All they got to do is go open up the door and go through. But I feel that they've been blocked, okay? They was trying to get through, but you done walked away, honey. And I think you done changed the locks. You abandoned me. Love don't live here anymore. Just a vacancy, honey. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, what y'all doing? Okay, that's all that. So so yeah, they want to come back and love bomb you, give you a cup of love, a night of cups or whatever, because they're sad and they're under judgment right now. Why? Because they're at the crossroads. They're sad, they're watching you get this nine of cups, wish fulfillment, and they want that to be them too. Look at them. They got the handout. Now I want to equal give and take with you. So spirit, uh-uh, that that's not how this works, boo. That's not how this work. You got your damn hand out. Look at them, they're going to try to message you. That they're going to need some money, honey. Oh, no, 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 no. Look at them. I'm in conflict and trouble and chaos after all the conflict they haven't tried to put you through, okay, and put you through a hardship and hard time, and you done survived, and you moving forward. Okay, they try to drown you with this eight of cups and you done came up out the water and left and they ain't looked back since. And now these people in sad and regret or depressed or this person is because, oh Lord. So why am I here an angel though, spirit? They think you the angel. Of course you are. Of course you are. What else, spirit? Shout out to Anita. Hey, girl. <laughs> oh, damn. They under judgment. I told you because shit is falling apart. They realize that you are the two of cups and they're trying to get back to you. Because ever since 
they walked away from you or you walked away from them. They've had nothing but a 10 of wands energy. And then you've had the six of wands energy, victory and success. Okay. Yeah. That's what had happened. And now we got an air sign or I don't know, Libra Aquarius or Gemini or uh, earth sign that want to come back to you now and offer you an ace of pentacles. Oh no, spirit. Mm -mm. Hold on. What is the motive, Spirit? What's the motive? I've heard money. What's the motive? What's the motive, though? Okay, so they want... Oh, that's what they... Okay. Well, I mean, the fool... Yeah, they feeling foolish right now. That's the judgment, but I, Spirit, I asked the motive. <laughs> Why? Are they, what is the motive for them to want to come back? They're trying to exercise... Oh, their motive is the wheel of fortune. Yeah, their motive is to equal out the scales and get some balance because their money is slowing down. So the motive is money, like I said, with that handout, with that handout, because you close the cycle with this person for their lies and deception and sneakery and trickery and every damn thing. Yeah, and that's what brought down the finalized tower. But now there's a tower that they're going through because I don't know, Spirit, what is the Six of uh, Cups and the Seven of Swords energy? Because they're heartbroken from someone from their past. This story keeps coming up. Because whoever they thought they were leaving you for, they thought that was their Two of Cups. But now they're feeling foolish because they took a leap of faith but brought them nothing but the Ten of Wands energy. And now you gone, baby, because whoever they got with, their past walked away from them and left them in regret and left them out possibly in poverty damn gina how they so this means your person must not have no money if they let allow if they left okay some if they got with somebody and whoever they're not together with no more so this person must be codependent yeah they don't have no money or very little or whatever why are they spirit what's the five of pentacles what's the five of pentacles oh what is this damn that shit was laid to rest so they could be sick like literally sick the five of pentacles is Money and how like this is health. This is every damn thing right now. Oh my god! Because this person doesn't know how to let go of shit. They they just hold on to all like everything tragic in their life, all the negativity. The, they don't release the past. They don't release. They don't release anything. They just hold on to it and hold on to it and hold on to it. And this is possibly causing somebody to have health issues, a heart problem. I see. Okay, so this heart problem is coming up again. That came up in the last reading. So your person could be having a health problem and they're wishing back for you to be to get wish fulfillment. They want wish fulfillment. They want they want you to invest in them. They feel because they walked away from their happiness. They walked away from their ten of cups. You were this person's ten of cups. You were their happiness. All you would try to do is help this person. You would invest in this person. You wanted to be the best that they could be. But this person didn't want that for themselves. And you can't want something better for somebody that they don't want for themselves. Does that make sense? Okay, so you're going to have to learn when to hold him and fold him. Which you have done because you are at the Eight of Cups. So you've walked away completely. Yeah. Now this person's facing judgment. Okay, or heavy burdens and hardships and stuff. They could be facing, you know, they are facing um, financial lack and health-wise as well. And they want to come back to you maybe so you can help them. Like I said, you ain't no damn caregiver like that. I mean, you really are. But not when this person is, tri no, fuck that. No, this person's too toxic. Baby, no, mm -mm, mm -mm. no, hell no, okay? And you don't deserve that. You deserve the best of the best, the cream de la crop, okay? Because that's what you give. But see, you have to learn who to give to. You just can't give to low vibrational people to expect that they're going to return that same energy. They're not. So it's up to you, high vibe, my babies, to discern who to give your love and attention to and who to withhold it from, okay? So you don't end up in this energy. So you don't end up feeling in the five of pentacles left out in the cold. If anybody makes you feel confused about communication or feelings or where things are headed, Spirit says it's time for you to walk away from all that damn energy. Those, those times are over, okay? Yeah, invest in yourself, my loves. Invest in yourself. When you invest in yourself, it, you're, it makes you happy. That makes divine happy. That makes God happy. You're a happier person when you invest in yourself, okay? Oh, see, and that's where your really Ten of Cups is, is really within you. It's not within anything or anyone around you. It starts within. This is coming from within. You're connected to source. Source is your happiness. That, 
is where you get your stability and your happiness from. And if you're going to find happiness and stability, it always starts in the, in, the, in the 5D and comes down into the 3D. It starts in the mind first. You have to have your mind right. That's why it says have your mind on God at all times. Okay, so you can be balanced out into this Ten of Cups energy. So no matter what storms and towers come your way, you're still able to move to calmer waters because of the light that shines and exudes within you and the connection that you have, the source, because you are the child of God of the Most High. Okay, baby? You are wish. All your wishes are going to be fulfilled. They are. Definitely. You are wish fulfillment. You are the love of God. And God is going to give you this Ace of Cups because you're giving yourself this Ace of Cups. Okay, you're holding back and restraining from people, places, and things that no longer serve your highest interest or their, or their or your good. Yeah, and you're protected. You're protective of your energy. You're protective of who you give your love to. And you're not paying attention to any of the bullshit or the shenanigans in the background. You don't have that time. You're focused. You're gone within. You had your spiritual awakening. And you are extremely connected to source and your ancestors. And this stresses this person <laughs> It stresses them out like, oh my God, because you didn't have a level up spiritually and a lot of you physically, okay? And this, look at you, Gemini, manifesting your best life, living your best life. You ain't going back and forth with these ninjas, okay? You're living your best life. You're balanced, tempered, you're full of love, you're pouring into love yourself, you're pouring into love of others that deserve it, and you're being victorious and successful, you're a healer, you're nurturing, you're balanced, you're loving. Some of y'all got some beautiful legs and stuff. Some of y'all, I hear big, pretty legs, skinny, pretty legs, whatever you, you got some beautiful legs, baby. Yes, and you're tapped the fuck in, Gemini, okay? You're very, very, very smart, sharp, analytical, definitely. Mm -hmm. You know esoterical knowledge and things like that. Yes, you do. Like I said, because you're the child of God, of course you do. And you stand up for what's right and you do the things that's right, okay? And like I said, so now you have to learn these lessons without the bad. You definitely can't appreciate the good. And to have this person not taking you through all this bullshit, you wouldn't know how to, you know, fight fight the way you need to fight. Had you not appreciated this bad to get into the good energy. Does that make sense? Okay. What else, Holy Spirit? And things are moving quickly for you because of that. Look at you. You've done moved and you done, look. Some of y'all about to step into this king of Pen this queen or king of pentacles energy very quickly, fast forward movement. You are being victorious and successful. Whatever you do, you heal, you love, your wish fulfillment. You could have your own platform, definitely. Whatever you do, you love what you do. People love you. It's just like a it's a, it's a beautiful thing. And then now here you are, Empress or Emperor. Take the energy however it goes. You could be the queen or the king of pentacles. Or the emperor, the empress, but you're moving forward into this energy. If you're not already in this energy, you're moving into this energy currently, okay? Um, yeah. And this person is in their shadow side still. And because you realize that and you see that now, the difference, the cycles of clothes, of clo the, the, the cycle has been complete. This person's frustrated. They really are. They don't want it to be, they don't want it to be over. So they're spying on you so they can feel when they can come in and get this rebirth from you. But it's over. Spirit said it's over. This is major, major energy moving forward. It's over. With the world, yeah, and the, yeah, it's over. Okay, we got the world in the chair. It's over. This is something this person can't stop. This is moving forward by God. Child, you got all these major archons. You got the magician, you got the empress. The world card, the chariot card, it like it's it's a lot. And then the rebirth card, the death card. Oh, you get a new beginning, babies. You do get a brand new beginning. What else? Yep, the knight of wands. So you have a you have new life. You got new life coming up right here. But somebody is sat of their energy and oh well. I don't know what the well, I don't know where this is going. Spirit, anything else you want to say? What what's going on with the Gemini shenanigan Karani Kaz? But nobody compares to you, baby. Of course, you are the empress or the emperor, okay? You're Victoria, you're the star, you're the wish fulfillment, you're the six of wands. So, Spirit, I want to know, why is this person trying to, like, I don't, I don't understand their thought. How, how come they won't move on? They need to move on. They need to move on, Spirit. They need to move on. But they have a part to play, you guys, okay? Hold on. They, well, they need to move on. They want to be the official person, too. Oh, no. Why won't they move on? They need to move on, spirit. They need to move on. What's preventing this person from moving on? They need work. They're stuck. Okay? 
That's why they're not walking away because they're stuck. They're juggling. They're imbalanced. They're a risk taker. They need money. They need work. Okay, so I'm hearing they're lazy. They don't know how to make up their mind. Once they start something, they stop. So they don't know how to complete things. Okay, now this cycle has already been over and completed, but yet they don't want that to be over. They still want it open because this person is lazy. They sleep all damn day. Okay, they're so depressed right now. This is depression. The five of pentacles and the four of swords. This is depression. Okay, because things are not moving forward. Things are slow and or I'm sick. My health is bad. I'm lacking something. They have the key. But maybe you got, I don't know what the fuck is up. Spirit, why the key? What's going on? And they foolish. They, they foolish. What else? Because they walk away from everything that they, look, they, they don't complete their work. Whatever they start, like I said, they don't finish it. Okay? And there's consequences to this person's actions. So if you don't start something, if you don't finish something you don't start, then there's not going to be completion. There's not going to be completion of anything. But you completed a cycle, but this person's not learning and healing from whatever they need to learn and heal from. But yet nobody compares to you. You're trying to learn and heal this person, but you can't do that, Gemini. They need to do it themselves. Yeah, here they come. Want to message you. Oh, let's work this out, baby boo. Oh, let's work this out, baby boo. Look at them wanting to come towards traveling towards you and everything. Because they're stressed the fuck out. They can't sleep. They're like, oh my God, because they're possibly sick. And look, when they message you, it's going to change your life. Hold on. It's going to change your life when they message you. Oh my God, they might message you that they could be literally sick. Pay, you know, I mean, I'm just saying endings for them. Oh my God. So what is the motive of this person's spirit? I need to know what the motive is. What's the motive of this person? Well, we know it's money. I feel it's money. What's the motive, Holy Spirit? They want a Ten of Cups, but what's the motive of the Ten of Cups? So they want... Mm. Spirit say, if you take that, it's going to... Mm -mm. right, that tells me everything. It's going to be a tower. It's going to be a straight up tower with the Wheel of Fortune right here. That's not good. Oh my God. If you reconcile with this person... Yeah, because they look at you as wish fulfillment, but they don't have anything to offer you. Because like I said, they will never, ever, ever complete something that they started. Yeah, it could be another Gemini like such as yourself or Cancer or Water Sign or any other sign. Yeah, but all they are is one child. They're going to try to come rushing in to try to work on this. I know they not. Y'all, they still in this Knight of Wands energy. Yeah, they're still in this Knight of Wands energy. And they're still in this shadow side energy and they haven't worked on anything, but yet they want to come rushing into you to offer you some type of commitment, marriage, or whatever the case may be. Yeah, let's work on this marriage. But all it's going to do is leave you stuck. That's where the tower comes in because this person's not going to help you. You're going to be doing everything by yourself and you're going to be adopting another grown ass child that's going to leave you sad and in the Five of Cups energy. If you invest in this energy, Spirit said, it's going to leave your ass in the Five of Cups at the end of the day. It's going to leave you all confused and conflicted. Like, why the fuck did you even get back with this person? Because you're trying to be all nice, trying to help somebody. Anyway, so what else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, you're going to end up in this energy all because you're trying to heal with the wrong one. You're under judgment. Not you, but if you get with this, you're going to be under judgment because you, and it was exposed to you about this person. They left you, every time you would try to heal with this person, you would always be in regret and remorse because they would leave you out in a cold over and over and over again. Because they would go travel, be a little hoe or, or whatever they would do in the dark and whatever they would do. They would always hold themselves back from you. So spirits are advising you to hold your back self back from this energy because you will be under judgment because it's nothing but a lie. It was a, a deception. Okay, it's an illusion. Okay, all they are, they want to move forward passionately towards you to have some sex. Okay, they do. I'm telling you, they want to move Sagittarius twice. They want to have some sex. They want to get that wand in and start fluing them juices around, honey. Mm -mm, mm -mm. And you're going to be like, what the fuck did I do? Exactly, baby. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And you're going to be like, me. you're going to need 911. So we don't know where he's been slithering this wand in, honey. It's been all over the world. It's been all over the streets, all over the neighborhood, all over the community, all over the fucking curb. Child, this motherfucker been slinging, or her, okay? She been opening, busting it open and everything, just pouring it out. Child, Jesus, it's too much. <laughs> Some of these people need to calm the hell down, okay? They they do. They really do. Child, they be 
busting it open for everybody. They get to drink in, they get to party in, child. Look at them, look at them, look at them. They get to drink in and party in, honey. They get loose. The goo, the juice gets you loose. Some of them may be drinking gray goose and stuff like that, but yeah, no. Some of y'all about to go to a house party, a little satanic demonic house party with an orgy going on. Y'all better watch out now, okay? I don't know. That's what some of y'all, not all of y'all. I just want you to know that, okay? Ooh, you're going to be like, what the fuck did I come into? I don't think you was going to expect that, Gemini high vibe. You wasn't. Um, Anything else, Holy Spirit, that you want my babies to know? Mm -hmm. Anything? I don't know. Okay. I see o OT Genesis start playing. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. King of Pentacles in the reverse. Slow. So whoever this energy is, they are in poverty. They are slow and lazy. Didn't I say they don't start stuff that they finish? Okay. They possibly get their money from ill-gotten gains illegally. They could possibly in be under investigation. They could be a drug dealer. They could be in the gang for the streets. They could do a lot of white-collar crimes, embezzlement. There's just not an honest person. This person could be facing some type of legal issues or whatever, but they do want to come rushing into you. Child, he got his genitals down on her. Child, I can't. This is too much. Okay? No. Spirit say cut it. Okay, that's all I'm saying. Jim and I cut it. Like OT Genesis. Okay, because the risk is way too high. You need to cut it. Okay? Yeah. Jim and I. That's you right there, baby. And this is what's coming towards you. A broke ass, slow ass, sad ass unethical, possibly abusive as well, okay, like a wife beater, if she's a woman, she's abusive to the man, very, you know, toxic in behavior, so, yeah, Gemini, and this is what's coming towards you, mm, mm, mm. so you already know what you need to do, I'm an angel reading right there, babies, oh, shit, until next time, my angels, I love you so much, and have a great rest of your day, bye.